Hello, good evening, good afternoon, good morning and welcome. My name is Nurse Richard the Wax Wizard. Thanks for joining me. Um, little compilation here. I think there's three years in it. Uh, memory serves me right. Nothing particularly uh, complicated or unusual or weird. Um, because the majority of cases we see are fairly straightforward. It's just a wax bug that's blocking uh, people's ears and they need to get it out. And not always um, something weird or wonderful. Um, but I know you, you like even these routine ones, so I thought I'd pop a few in these for you. Um, not the biggest of ears, this one. Uh, and as you can see, it goes all the way back down there. So I'm just kind of manipulating it. You're trying to give it a little shape, side to side, and it is slowly bring, uh, being brought forward. And you can see the further down it goes, the darker it is. A lot of you regulars will know why this is. It's basically, if a tissue is more dead, it gets more black. Is the long and short of it. It's to do with the, uh, to do with the uh, oxidization. I won't blind you with the science of it. There's other channels that you can go into for that. That's not what my channel is about. As those who've been watching for a while will probably already know. Or we'll just watch these videos, have a chat. And that's, that's pretty much it. You learn a few little things, great. It's not primarily what I'm for. I don't want to blind you with the science of anything. Like I said, there's, uh, there's plenty, uh, plenty of channels who do, who, do that, who do that kind of stuff a lot better than I, than, than I probably could anyway, to be honest with you. But it still keep coming, this. It must have been full front to back. I'll be honest, I don't remember it that much. <laughs> it was a while ago when I put this on. Uh, when I did this procedure, sorry. And each time you bring another bit, it bring, each time you pull one bit out, it's brought another bit forward. I think that might be the last of it. Yeah, it is. There you go. So you can see just from the marks and the stains uh, where that was. And it was pretty much all the way back down. And thankfully it didn't leave much down there. A few little bits and bats, but... Not going down there to get them. Absolutely no need. You need a little bit of air wax. It's good for you. Um, this one looks very round, this, doesn't it? The reason for that is um, it was quite quite close, this um, chap's ear canal. And so I got him to pull it open, which can make it a lot easier. It literally creates more space for you to pull these things out and then you've got more, you've got more wiggle room. You can literally just see better because it's not like that, it's like that. And all you have to do for that is get your armour in the back of your head and just pull it upwards and back. Um, and I do that quite a lot. Uh, if the patients can't do it, then you have to sometimes prop it open with the tools you've got. Uh, a lot come with family members, uh, especially uh, a lot of the older people that come, come with their grown-up children and I ask them to help and they're more than happy to. But it does make it a lot easier. And again, no, nothing big or complicated or unusual about this one. Just left a little bit there, a tangle in the hairs, didn't it? I did go back and get that. <laughs> Last one here, again, looks not too dissimilar to the one that we've just seen. A bit stickier, this one, from what I remember. And you can tell I don't think this, um, it was a lady, I think, who didn't have any um, anybody with her or couldn't quite grab her ear well enough. So in cases like this, you use your tools to open up the uh, open up the ear. Either the endoscope or the suction tube or both. You know, you can have one, literally one on either side opening it apart like that. It's just left a bit of this sticky wax around the side there and on the base of the ear canal. So we'll do our best to peel away what we can there. We've quite stuck this bit from what I remember. So you can see a layer of skin, can't you? They're just peeling away and exposing the fresh new, uh, fresh new skin. I don't think we've got every speck of this, but it really isn't important. When someone comes to our ear wax move, your primary aim is to clear the blockage so they can hear again. As I said before, anything else, bonus it's a bonus and um, really not essential because you need to leave a little bit in there um the earwax, earwax itself is is healthy for you having a little bit if you don't have any at all uh, you can get quite dry and itching irritable so you do need a, a, a fine coating of it and a few bits here and there anyway there's the end of that one anyway i hope you enjoyed that little compilation 
stay tuned for more. Hopefully I get something a bit more weird and wonderful in too, but I can only show you what comes, what comes in through the door. Uh, but for now, take care of yourselves and I'll see you later. Bye-bye.